getting barreled is probably one of the best things about bodyboarding. Um, it's, it's, I think, every bit as, I mean, getting a good, deep, heavy barrel, I think, is in some ways every bit as complex as doing a big move. Riding a bodyboard's great because you can drag your legs and you can drag the, your body in the face of the wave to slow you down. It's as, it's as simple as making slight little adjustments with your, with your fins or with your legs, dragging them in the face and just timing it with, with the way that the, the barrel's um, speeding and slowing. If it's a really sucky, heavy wave, you want to you drop in and, and uh, sort of drag your legs into the face and straight into the barrel, you'll, you'll probably land inside the barrel. Aim high so the shockwave doesn't blast you off your board. And if the shockwave's going to come up under you, it will actually it'll wedge you and push you out of the barrel. This is where a wave might look like it's fattening out or it might pinch, or if a section washes down, um, you just basically you've got to aim for that spot that you can see and put your body in that right direction. If you have a little bit of time, you know it's going to barrel, but you have a little bit of time, you can throw in a little half turn to slow you down. I mean, if, if you want to push a little bit more, you can try chuck a spinner in the, in the pocket and, and you'll, you'll end up in the barrel, hopefully. Oh, there's, there's just so many things you can do in and around the barrel. It just makes it such a, like a fundamental part of bodyboarding.